Yes. Come on now. You better listen up. I have to tell you something very important. Deep down in the underground, there is a group of very, very dangerous moles. And they are known as the Bucklers. This secret organization, this gang of moles. They organize themselves, they meet up underground and have their secret meetings where they discuss the things they will do. Well, you may ask yourself, what do the bucklers do? Indeed, their name suggests that they may be shielding something or perhaps protecting their own, but that is not the case. In fact, they are the bucklers because they are somewhat of a swashbuckling group. You see, they are pirate moles. They roam every night up to the land surface and they search for things to pillage and steal. And then they take them back into their underground lairs and they sing and dance and celebrate their conquest and their looting. And they sing. We are the bucklers, we are the bucklers. Better get out of our way, we're gonna make you stay. We are the bucklers, we are the bucklers. No shields for us, no. We just take what we want. Yeah, well, now, you will never hear their song, of course, because they are deep underground, these moles. And when they come to the surface, they are deadly silent. Nobody ever hears them coming. And when they do sneak up upon a person, they dig a hole under them really fast and make them fall into the ground. And then once you are deep, deep below the ground, they say, Welcome to the bucklers. And then they force you to go through an initiation process through which you become a mole. And once you are one of the moles, you sing with them. We are the bucklers. We are the bucklers. And you forget the rest of the, the part, but after a while you start to know it because they're very kind and they continue repeating it while you listen. And now that you are one of the bucklers, you must go up and you must say, Arr, I am a swashbuckling mole myself and I will steal. And then you go into stores and houses and public places and you take what you want because you are a buckler. But this group, the bucklers, they are not completely impenetrable. In fact, there was once a mole amidst the moles, a sub-buckler, in fact, they called him the Swash Swisher, because he was infiltrating the group of swashbuckling pirate moles known as the bucklers so that he could re relay information to authority figures who sought to capture the bucklers. He told them, ah oh, yes, they are meeting. 10,000 miles underground below the town hall this Sunday. And of course, the police said, that's way too far underground. We could never hope to reach these bucklers. And indeed, indeed, 10,000 miles underground is quite into the, the magma coat of the surf of the planet. So it, it, it was indeed unreachable for them. It seemed almost untrue. How could the bucklers possibly be that deep? Perhaps it was an exaggeration. And so they suspected that their mole amidst the moles, their swash swisher, had betrayed them and in fact become a triple mole, a triple agent. He was the swish swash swackler. And they sent him back to go steal information for them once more. But this time, they put a tracking device on him so that they could see where he was going despite his lies. But it turns out he was not lying at all. In fact, moles simply had a different system for measuring, you know, distance underground. And when they said 10,000 miles under town hall, in fact, it was only about 10,000 millimeters which, as you know, is, is 10 meters. So, 
They were not that far underground. In fact, with a close ear to the ground in town hall, you could hear them swashbuckling about below the town. And so the enforcers of the law sought to go there on that fateful day and intercept the bucklers and put an end to their buckling, their swashing, and all of their illicit behavior. So they set up a buckler mortar, a device which would shoot shells of molten steel into the ground and detonate to create explosions which would propel the bucklers from the ground into a cage they had built specifically to capture them. And so they placed the cage in place. They activated the, the buckler mortar and they shot the bomb and it went into the ground and it detonated. Bucklers were sent flying up into the air and they landed in the cages and the police said, ha, you bucklers who have tortured this city for so long and caused such devastation. Now we have you, and you will buckle no longer. And the bucklers said, You cannot ever stop us, for we are moles. And then they, they dug a hole through the ground and they escaped. Yes, it was quite an oversight indeed. They were literal moles, not, not people. <laughs>